Speaking in that vein, guys, I have to do one more. The last time I was in the court, of course, they were throwing me out on the street. They rounded up all these women. There must have been 10, 15 women down there. And, and you could tell they all weren't the wealthy, uh, good old boys and girls that I know around here for parking tickets, okay? Must have been slow after uh, football season, huh, Mr. Spencer? Uh, the Super Bowl parties up there. So we're rounding up all these women to give them you know, parking tickets. It seemed a little odd. Of course, they did nothing to me. Judge me sick. Uh, this lawyer, Moriel. Say, you know, same nonsense I've been down there numerous times for. Um, but, but this is what we have down there at our court system. We have continuation of, you know, incarcerating, impoverishing, arresting poor people in this community. You know, we, we have the same people dealing drugs. Now they're moving into trafficking. Um, you know, we don't call it that around here. Oh no, we call it renting a room, you know, or how about the in-law apartment? I'm going to talk about that. The Cernax had an in-law apartment. Okay. And the abuse there was so bad. I, you know, I almost didn't get out with my life. They're upside down on their mortgage. They were constantly on Craigslist scamming. Judge Gilson, Judge Skoda, Judge Jennings, uh, a new judge, a less, what, it begins with A. Oh, he's a, he's a goomba buddy of her, uh, a good old boy buddy of Sice. This is what we have in Fulton County. Right now I'm in the town of Amsterdam, so, you know, we got a whole other mess up there in Fulton County um, with these groups of people that are very radicalized. Uh, you, you know, they're involved with this the extreme Trump rhetoric. You know, I won't get into his policies. You know, I'm not a political person. But when I hear ra the radicalization of people that I, you know, I've known all my life talking this kind of hatred and considering what they've done to me, we need to speak out. We, we, and we have to say we don't want this in our community. We don't want our children affected by this putrid, vile hatred because it corrodes. It corrodes and it, and it, and it wears away at the foundations of our democracy. It wears away about the, uh, underneath the health of our communities. It wears away of people being doing to doing business. Housing should be a human right. These judges had absolutely no consideration for me because they're all good old boys. Um, we had, uh, you know, and the other judge in Kanjahari, um, Gizzy. So there's these judges, these lawyers involved, and we really need to clean house. Be safe, guys.